I am just really... Oh good, my target pistol's a shotgun now. I'm just really having a fine time with it tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my god, where did you come from? That's not good. That's one of the big boys. Where the default fuck was he? I guess I was hearing his weird, uh... Shit, that sucks. I don't even think I can get through there. Not, don't run that way, you moron. Well, I guess he can't. He's so slow. I gotta drink one of those adrenaline drinks I was making fun of earlier. Lock's broken. I know I missed a couple doors already. I must have. Oh. Get in there. There's a new enemy. I was just gonna say, there's a new enemy that gets introduced. And there it is. Wow, it's kicking my ass. Uh, oh my god, I'm almost dead. Why can't I? Okay. Um, I feel like I need a... Oh, shit. I'm doing terribly. Oh my god, I just used two health drinks. I'm still nearly dead. Let's blast its ass with the sh... I'm gonna use the freaking rifle on this thing. Is this still alive? It's a, like, pretty... It's like a decent monster design, but like... I don't know. Just anybody other than Masahiro Ito doing monster designs, I'm like, no. It's like two people sort of sewn together via their ass. Ooh, that freaked me out. See, the thing is, I, I, I should go back and check all these other rooms first. I don't think there's gonna be anything... You know, that's probably worth it. Honestly. But we know this is where we need to go next, so... Let's get out there, let's check everything else out. Save the game, because God knows I'm beautiful and near death at this point. We're gonna get through this together, folks. Alright? We've come a long way. What is What use is a walkthrough if the person's, like, uh, you know, glorious at the game? Right? Doesn't help anybody. Now it's unlocked. Let's go through it to make sure. While I take a delicious sip of Diet Sunkiss. Now that's refreshing. You'd think the PS3 would load this thing like instantaneously. Guess shit doesn't work like that. Alright, let's cut across here and see if we can get into that staff room. Probably not. Is it not in this building? It's on the other side. I don't like my odds here. Especially if I can't get into that staff room. Nope. Alright, time to get hit by this monster. Juked. Like an expert. Can I even go through here? No. Let's see if I can go through here. Travis's slow monkey ass. Didn't I just do that? I guess that was a different door I unlocked. Kind of weird. I don't remember being in here, but it acts like I have been, so. I'm gonna assume that I, not yet, wait, what is it? Not yet, I need to get to the bottom of this. Why was I led here? Fuck off. This game does that more than like any other. No one would give a shit. I feel like the only time, no, it's not true. Maybe it is. I feel like the only time Silent Hill 2 pulled that shit was when it was like, at the very beginning of the game, if he tried to, to leave, he was like, nah dude, I came here to find Mary. And then it makes sense, he hasn't already seen, like, Pyramid Head trying to cut his balls off with a giant knife. If he had seen that, he'd probably be like, yeah, dude, no, it's fine, I'm pretty sure Mary's dead. Alright, I need to check those two bottom doors. Probably get killed in the process, this will be fun. You guys are gonna love this, you're gonna love my nuts. That's, uh... What's his name, Vince from ShamWow? That guy was great. He made like two infomercials and then fucked off forever. I think he was like a violent douchebag in real life. You know, never meet your heroes type deal. Or live long enough to become a villain. Something about being a villain. Oh my god, no. I don't want to do this. <sighs> Good. Two shots take you down. Um, how much hunting rifle ammo do I have? Because I know I need to use it on the boss, but... Okay, so we got four shots, plus... 
Eh. I have a decent little chunk, but it, unless this room has more hunting rifle ammo, probably not worth it. I also got hit by him once already. Shotgun ammo. Eh. I, fuck it, I'll take it, I guess. I wonder if two shotgun shots would have done the same. What a good sound effect. Listen to that. Nice. We're going to keep the shotgun going from now on, boys and girls. Alright, let's... Before we check this out, we're going to run to the right. And then I don't think I need to check... Eh. Probably should. I think it's locked, though. That little alleyway. It's a stupid ass. Where the fuck was he last time? He wasn't in here. Okay, the lock's broken. Yeah, you're alive. Cool. I killed your friend, but not you, I guess. Yeah. That's what I thought. I have vague memories of this. Get away from me, piece of shit. Alright, we were going to room 306, which is right there. Alright. Let's go in the mirror, folks. Gotta go into a mirror every once in a while. I'm not a big fan of this Zelda style of level design. It's like this time something's different. Ooh. Nightmare World's very fucked up here. Also, not to just complain, but like this version of the Nightmare World is basically just like what. To, uh, Alessa sees. I miss you so intensely watching them take you away. It was like a dagger through my heart. It had to be done, but now I'm so alone. Tra doctor's office, I told Travis you were dead. Maybe it would be better if you were. Helen, will you ever come back to me? Yours forever, Richard. These are just dog shit parents. Like, the worst parents in the world. Yeah, one of them tried to kill her son, and then the other one said that she was dead, and then killed himself. Spoiler alert, he kills himself. Um, it's like... I don't know. If my wife tried to kill my son... I'd be sad, and they, like, had to commit her. How did I miss that door, supposedly? Yeah, that's a door, I guess. Um, I'd be bummed out, but I'd probably be like, yeah, she should be committed. Try to kill my freaking son. This shit's fucked up. This aggression will not stand, as we've said. Fuck you. Okay. And now I can't... I have to unequip the goddamn gun when I want to actually stop their nuts out, because... God knows he will just shoot them like an idiot. Spear. Kind of want to just use that for the... Because it's a spear. I mean... Come on. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. As long as I can not take damage and actually accrue some health items. Accrue. I need a crew to play this game. I need the crew to play this game. The crew is that uh, car game. Ah, uh, this is a really bad port. But this entire YouTube channel is just a, a, my means of exposing Matt to every Silent Hill game for some reason. The music all stopped. Interesting. Somebody's still walking around. I can hear him. Staff accommodation. Where are you, you little bitch? I think I see you there. Ta oh my god, the input lag is so freaking bad. Okay. Again, I think this is fine. I don't think I actually take damage from this as long as I do the prompts correctly. And then I can just punch his lights out. Two. Three. Four. Five. Can't see anything, but... Pretty sure he's down. Yep. <clears throat> I wonder who is the best... Who is the best Silent Hill protagonist? I kind of like James. And, you know, he's a murderer, so that says a lot. Um, no, but James has got, you know, he's got the most... He's got the right mixture of personality and um, not not too much personality. Like, Heather's cool. She probably has the most 
it might be Heather. I don't know. She's got the most personality. And she, like, comments on stuff in ways that other protagonists don't. But she's also, like, kind of annoying. And she doesn't have, like... She, like, tries to do one-liners, but they're not good. You know? She yells, uh... At Claudia, when, when Claudia's trying to get her to birth the god at the end. She yells, uh... Shut your stinking mouth, bitch. And that's... I mean, that's okay, I guess. It's not much of a... Doesn't have much zip to it. Needs a needs a punch up. Needs a bit of a punch up. Heather, you need a punch up. And then you got Travis, who, speaking of punch up, he can punch very effectively. But uh, you know, he's kind of a got the personality of a wet blanket. He kind of sucks, you know. Jeez, that was a weird sound effect. Okay, I have officially explored everything in here. So just so you know, if you're playing through, that one room is the only thing really worth uh, going for. There's something big walking around over here. There it is. I found it. Uh, Christ, alive. Oh my god! Sorry, it's just... These things manage to get me, and I'm... I don't understand how sometimes. The thing is, it's not worth killing, because I'm pretty sure I like don't come back here. But boy, is he annoying. The gate is rusted shut. Yeah, well, tell me something I don't know. I liked that uh, James's nightmare world was, like, different. You know, everything was, like... I mean, it still had kind of, like, a rusty burned aesthetic, but everything was kind of, uh... Where the hell am I now? Did I go back to where I came from? I should heal. No, I went to... I went to the right place, though. Supposedly there's a way up there, which I didn't realize. Let's heal. God, just getting fucking blasted. Blasted in the ass. <sighs> really pl not playing good here. I can't, and I can't see shit. If I was like a professional, <clears throat> which I'm not. <sighs> Arr, you son of a bitch. Those do like massive fucking damage, so I recall. I should just run up to him. Because then they do the leg grab on me. Now let's see how much horrible damage I've taken. Pretty bad. God damn. I don't know. I may have to do like a... I may like have to do a save and whatever run through. Something's dripping. Pick it up! If it seems like I'm being very aggressive, it's just because I've had to do this twice now, and I don't want to. Something's dripping, but literally nothing I go and explore in this room is is doing anything. So, we're just going to say there's a drippy noise, and that's that. I'm supposedly in this room, and there's nothing else in here. So, let's leave. I should kill this little dumbass thing out here. I have way more bullets than health. So, like, where's that noise? I cannot see shit. I may have to just stop this and put new batteries in my TV remote. Just so I can turn up the brightness. Because I can't see shit. Where are you, dude? I'm also just... I'm also just trying to kill the thing because I'm worried it's going to jump out and hit me. Oh my god, there's apparently another thing. Where are you? There you are. What in the fuck? Oh, it's one of those. Alright, let's do this. Uh, let's... No, don't examine it. Make equip your first option. Don't make me fucking scroll down to it. Two shots, that's it. Good to know. Let us reload the shotgun. Turn it into another gun. And then continue on with our lives. How much shotgun ammo do I have? That's a decent amount. Because those things are those things are tough customers. 
I'm walking because if I run, I can't see shit. So, where are we? Where do we think we're trying to go here? To these doors that I can't see. Wow, that was lucky. Just kind of picked one. Dude, I need I need to turn up the freaking brightness on this shit. All right, we're gonna do a maneuver. Uh, be right back. All right, I had to go into my basement, find batteries to put in this freaking thing. Now I can like reasonably see. You should see the gamma on my TV right now. Like the blacks are like pretty much white. I understand making things dark, but wait, there's a mirror in the bathroom here. When did that happen? Okay. Um, but yeah, man, can't see shit. I apologize for complaining as much as I do in this, but it's just, you know, it's not a conducive way to play uh, games. It's weird that I have a channel for playing games. Okay, I can at least see decently now. Kind of. Okay, I'm gonna fuck you up, you little bitch. I shoot him right in the asshole. Okay, one shot does it. That's pretty good. Shotguns are good, you know? In real life and in video games. I wouldn't know, actually. I don't, uh, I've never shot a shotgun in my life. Why do I say these things? Like, uh, trying to be cool? It's not cool. There's a shitload of monsters out here, apparently. I don't know why I'm going around killing them. I should... Uh, let, I'm only going to kill them if they get in my way. How about that? I need to preserve some ammo, and I need to... Definitely get more health. Because I am getting owned here. Appears to be nothing in this room. Except some cool music. I fucking... I can't stand the melee weapons. Who is really having that much of an issue? If they need a bunch of melee weapons. I need health items, game. So, I don't know. If, if, if Konami is working on another Silent Hill game... Like, I would care if it was Kojima, because Kojima is kind of like a... Sort of visionary type dude. Um, and he, uh, he cares a lot about the work that he does. And like, I just, I don't get the sense that Konami has ever put uh, these games in good hands. You know, like you look at the, the games, the Silent Hill games that I like, I like sort of in spite of themselves. Like, Downpour is, is okay, I think, because it happened to fall into the hands of a team that actually gave a shit about it. And it's still only like half good. You know, there's a lot of stuff in that game that is goofy as shit and kind of just broadly ill-advised. Okay. Yeah, that's what I thought. Time to unequip my gun so I can stop this boy. Please stop him. God damn it. God damn, this is stupid as shit. Did you see how quickly he just turned around like that? It's because it wouldn't let me stop him. Okay, no harm, no foul. We have killed everything. Kill everyone now! Uh, divine. Gone too soon. Okay. What have we not explored? Let's look. There's a door directly in front of me. This game's pretty linear. And I... No, there's absolutely no door right in front of me. Game. Okay, good. It acknowledges this. So let's go back, and it's going to be the fourth door on my side. I'm going to fuck that up, but we're going to try it. One. Uh, two, three. Yeah, see. It's hard when some of the doors are just vague, like, open spaces. This is the wrong one. Yep. It's all the way down there. I am I am a fool. A fool. I bet you there was someone at home. Uh, their brain was just melting when they said, actually I don't bet that because I think these videos get about 10 views each, but that's okay. There's someone playing through Silent Hill Origins right now who is hooked on this content. Especially the fact that I keep checking the map every 10 seconds. They love that in particular. Maybe if I just uh, focus a little less on this biting commentary and instead just focus on the video game, uh, it would be better. So that means that I have not explored everything because there's this whole wall of rooms. 
That one, nothing. This one. I like that sound. Is that just like a spooky sound of like something under the grates? That's cool, if so. It's probably not. It's probably like some monster is gonna jump out and piss me off. This room has the police tape. Oh, this is the this is the scary room. Okay, now we have checked everything. Good to know that that is a locked door. We can go in. Oh, wait, we didn't quite check everything. There's apparently a door in here that I did not even see. Is that real? I guess it's right here. Yep, okay. Now we can go. Um, but, you know, Konami would give this game to, like, some, some company that's made one video game before called, like, Turd Farmer, and they're located in Poland or something, and, you know, they'd probably give it their all with a shoestring budget. But it wouldn't make sales. And they'd go, see, this franchise is dead. Wait, what? Strange drawings. Some of them are scratched into the walls. Others look like they're painted. 